and today we're off to Shanghai. Uh, so after some last minute uh, food shopping for our train ride, we are now waiting at the bustling Wudangshan train station. And here comes our train which we will be on for the next 24 hours. We've arrived in Shanghai and this is our room we'll be staying in and we are very happy that there are in fact three beds as advertised. <laughs> so our first stop in Shanghai is East Nanjing Road. Uh, this is the main city centre with lots and lots of shopping. Uh, but first off really all we're interested in is lunch. We've made it down to the Bund where you can see the old European style architecture on one side of the river and then on the other side of the river you can see the new Shanghai, all the modern tall buildings. Uh, we'll probably come back in the evening sometime so we can see the city lit up. Cozy for you. We're going to go up one of the tall buildings in Shanghai and we've decided to go up this one, commonly referred to as the bottle opener. this cool model of Shanghai at the bottom in the basement of the building before you go up. This is the elevator ride on the way up. A little bit of a light display as you go. So this is how quickly we're going up.
like me. It's funny. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 435 minute, metres in just about a minute. The lower car is now in service. Nice lit up floor. They tried to make the whole thing pretty high tech. And this is the view from the 95th floor. A little bit of haze. Um, but we're up here around sunset, so hopefully we'll get some a pretty nice view. And now we're up on the 100th floor, and as with so many of these things, the picture probably doesn't give the view true justice. You can see some of the boats coming up the river. There's quite a few people up here tonight. On the 94th floor there's uh, souvenir shops. <laughs> and also a bar, so you can sit down and have a drink in the bottle opener, which seems kind of appropriate. And here's the building from the bottom at night once we've come back out.